a leasehold. If you don't know what that is, don't feel bad. I just found out recently too. Uh, I'm, from, I'm from Florida. It's not really popular in Florida. It's very popular in Hawaii and New York, um, New York City, in Hawaii a lot. So um, I'm just gonna explain it very fast. On Zillow, when it says other property information, always look down to see special conditions, land tenure, H. I mean L H leasehold. Obviously, L H stands for leasehold. I don't know why they put it twice, but they did that to be quirky. But either way, in long, let's see that they say it here. Now, these people don't say it, but these people do say it. Maybe. And you click their property. Look, lease hold to 2054. It's actually a long time from now. But some other ones we see are like from 2036, some even in the 2020s. No one wants to buy someone that's going to expire in the 20s. That You only have a couple years left. It's going to be very cheap. Um, or they're just going to hold it until to see what happens. Because sometimes they can renew it. Some people renew it. It's a, it's a risk. But it's better than just getting rid of it for free before. Um, that's a long time. You have plenty of time. And this is a pretty good location right in Honolulu. The HOA fee is expensive. That's the only thing, but in long, basically, long story short, to explain this very clearly, you basically buy this lease that someone else has. They're leasing the land. Some company built a building, and then sold each individual unit as a lease until this date. Um, so it's like, it's like renting, but like you own the rental, but you still have to pay rent. The rent is the HOA fee, but you're stuck in this, um, and then. By 2054, they can decide to take your house away from you. Or they can charge any price for HOA. And there's no limit they can charge. They can charge $10,000 a month. But, or you can just surrender your house. and so, Or they can just take it if they want to. It's their choice. After the lease, there's no rules. Um, so that's why they're really cheap. But if you're old, it doesn't matter. Like If you're old, that's why people don't really care. They're like, oh, I'll be old by then. I'll, I'll, I'll be at a retirement home by then. But but I'm going to be 54 in that year. So I'm going to be in my 50s. Even if I bought this now, I'll literally be in my 50s. So that would be like, I'm, I probably would sell it by then anyways. I'm just giving an example. So that's like basically what a leasehold is. This is obviously a leasehold too. There's no way it's not. Yeah, December 2048. It's a pretty long time. That's a pretty good deal, too. But let's see. Another one. Let's see this $300,000 one. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, my God. 2037? They're asking this much? Jesus. I don't know why. I think almost every house in Hawaii is a leasehold. Or every condo, it seems like. I want to find one that's not. Wow. So, I think fee simple means it actually goes up a certain percent every year. And I hate how people don't put information about the leasehold. It's so rude. A studio. Is there any... That's oh yeah, I have it set for this price to find leaseholds. Let me just do any price. Let me see if this is a leasehold or not. Nine hundred a month. Oh my gosh. Four almost four hundred thousand dollars for a leasehold? Why? It, it ends soon? It doesn't even say they, they should be required to say okay let's just see if this million dollar one's a leasehold if this is a leasehold I'm gonna freak out there's no way it's a leasehold are you kidding me oh I'm actually super stupid yeah so this actually means I, I just misread it 
fee simple means um HOA or you own it for life but it's expensive bro and it can only go up so bruh. 